All right, so today is Saturday, March 7th, and Nick and I are out here doing a little bit of shed hunting. And over the past couple shed seasons, we've kind of been noticing certain trends where we're finding sheds. And today we're out here, you can see a cut bean field behind me, and then there's a few blocks of timber from three different landowners we have permission to be shed hunting. And uh, we ended up finding this smaller shed in just a kind of a, I don't want to say an open hardwoods, little bit of, you know, thicker stuff, but not much. And you're always hearing people say, you know, you're going to find sheds in these nice grassy areas or these real thick areas where deer are bedding. And uh, occasionally that may be true, you know, we've found sheds in those types of areas. However, more and more we've noticed that we're finding a lot of antlers in these real open hardwoods. And I know Nick's found, I don't know, five or six sheds this year and just about every single one's been in that type of area. This smaller one was in that type of area. And then we came into this last section of woods where we're gonna be heading back to the truck. And uh, literally the second we stepped in here, I told Nick, I said, this is just, or actually he said it, this is the type of area where, you know, you're gonna find those, those sheds. Sure enough, we're getting to it, probably only 100 yards into this block of timber. And this thing was laying tines down. So kind of wanted to just, uh, kind of maybe give you guys that tip if that helps you find any. I know a lot of people think those grassy areas or real thick areas are where the bucks are going to be in the late season. However, we're beginning to think that's not so much the case. Uh, these open hardwoods, uh, food sources nearby seem to be the go-to for finding antlers. Yeah. 